that may be. Before you get too excited, yes, I'm free to play, everything works, um, full control, etc. Um, however, I just want to show you this is streaming from my PC. Now, the thing about this is, is that um, this is the Yuzu emulator, and I integrated a command line into Steam so I could launch it. Now, if you see up here, I had troubles trying to get it to be full screen, but it didn't need to be. And it takes less uh, resources on my computer to run it in this native smaller mode, but it shows up on here in full screen as that whole section up there. It, the Steam app only shows me that section, so it uh, makes less of a struggle for the computer to uh, uh, do it anyway. So, Anyway, you know, and if I want to get out of this, um, I hold, since it's, I hold that, you can see down at the bottom, I can say, stop this game, and it will actually stop the executable because it's ran in a command line. So, now, it's completely back to the menu, and the, in the background, the actual Yuzu app has, um, has stopped and you no know, longer running. So, just wanted to show you that quickly. Um, you know, obviously, uh, I would love for the, um, let's see, let's hit stop and we'll play. You know, I'd love for the Skyline app, you know, to be able to play, but it's not quite there yet, so instead, Using the Steam Steam Link app, uh, connecting to my computer, which has lots of horsepower. Um, the Yuzu, I made a copy of my own Zelda off of my uh, my Nintendo Switch, you know itself, and um, and then yeah, there we go. So anyway, um, yeah, it's it's a lot of fun. It's uh, I was trying to figure out how to make the settings appropriately. Um, let me take this off here real quick. Put that right there. I just want to show you that, you know, I tried several um, lines up here. Um, and what came out best was that worked, but not full screen, was the C drive where your Yuzu EXE is, and then a space, and then exactly where your game is located you know for um on what drive letter mine's on a root of e drive so and then so that allows me to just tell the game to start and then it's in a, a command line window and then when i'm ready to quit i use the command inside the steam link it actually tells the command to stop the command line and uh yeah it works perfectly thanks